now I'm going to draw I just drew my whole foundation floor that's a foundation uh, let me go ahead and save this in case anything happens save on my desktop eight by twelve shed save yes. okay okay as you can see I drew all my foundation stuff uh, got my runners underneath it these are uh, runners are are uh, four by sixes my floor joists are two by sixes my rim joist two by six and as you can see underneath here there's space 24 inch on center and I got three quarter inch OSB as my uh, subfloor so I'm gonna get busy laying out my wall plates and draw the walls gonna hit R for rectangle and I just draw this uh, on here first first dimension I'm gonna make this 5.5 gonna hit click gonna hit push pull P gonna go up gonna hit 1.5 gonna make this a component triple click right click make component create hit rectangle uh, rectangle draw here uh, let's see hit comma 1.5 hit my push pull tool uh, I'm gonna have a double top plate and I think I want to make my walls a seven feet tall so in order to do that I'm gonna need to make these studs uh, uh, six foot seven point five inches Okay, now I'm going to click on this, make this a component, create, I'm going to scroll in a little bit, I'm going to select the stud, hit the move tool, I want to keep my 24 inch on center layout, so I'm going to start off with 23.25, now I'm going to come here, I'm going to highlight again. And as I'm dragging it, I'm going to hit the control button. Uh, now I'm going to hit make this 24 inches. I'm going to hit the top, I'm the X button to be a multiplier. I want to do this a couple more times, so I'm going to type in X. Now, how many more times do I want to do it? So I'm just going to type in six. And that made that uh, build more. Uh, looks like I built too many, so I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that one, delete it going to zoom in here you can see this is an overhang so I'm going to select that hit the M tool come here and snap that to the edge okay now I'm going to come up here hit R for rectangle draw this draw my rectangle hit my push pull tool come up at 1.5 now I'm going to triple click this make this a component create I'll highlight all these I'm going to make these a group I'll make a group now since I drew that side I'm going to come here select the group uh, hit move kind of zoom in get get this little corner here and as I'm zooming it I'm gonna hit the control button I'm gonna come over here and snap it to that corner and I drew that side okay um, now what I'm gonna do is draw uh, I'm going to draw some sheathing. I'm going to make my sheathing go from the uh, top of this stud. Actually, I'm going to go... Uh, hmm. Let me start here.
just going to come up here to the edge, kind of zoom in. So I just going to start. I started. Uh, oh, let me show you this again. Um, let me uh, undo this. I, I like to make my sheathing overhang, let it hang down a little bit. So I'm going to start where the bottom of my floor joist are. That's just the way I like to do it. I don't like making it even with the with just the sole plate because then your sheathing, if your sheathing stops here, there's kind of a gap there and water could work its way in if you're building a real shed. So I, I tend to make this overhang. Uh, so I'm going to start here, click on this corner, zoom up, and hit back R. I'm just going to click it right, click it uh, right about right here. I'm going to leave the first number, I'm going to hit comma. I make this four foot. Comma forty eight. Okay. All right. So now I'm going to uh, see how this looks. Okay. I do a rectangle. I come up here to the edge. I hit comma four foot. Now I'm going to come here. Just go up to the corner. Use my push pull tool. I'm going to make this uh, 0.5. Yeah, highlight. Uh, highlight. Bring this out to here. And make it match. Gonna triple click here. Right click. Make this a group. Gonna hit B. Gonna draw this as OSB. So I'm gonna paint that. And should be done now. Yeah. Okay. Well, now that I have this drawn, I'm gonna zoom in. Right here, I'm going to select this. Now I'm going to hit my move tool. Highlight right here. On the right bottom right corner of this, I'm going to drag it. And as I'm dragging, I'm going to hit the control button to make a copy. And now I'm just moving it over. Snapping it to line. I'm not going to do it that way. I'm just going to draw it on here. Okay. Gonna hit comma. Four foot rectangle. Rectangle. I hit comma four foot. Rectangle. Come up here, snap it to this edge. Hit push pull, come out 0.75, sorry, 0.5, grab this, drag it, jeez, 0.5. this uh, group I like my group hit B for the paint I'm gonna make this OSB so I drew that hit select okay ah, well actually let me go ahead and 
paint my studs. I'm going to click that. Click that. I'm going to hit the B button for make this. Okay. Should have painted those a while ago, but didn't. <laughs> 